We are on our way to sample one of the hottest culinary, I don't want to say fads or trends, I just want to say that it's something that has recently become quite popular the past few years, and that's Nashville hot chicken. Nashville hot chicken is a very particular kind of spice blend that most people say originated with Prince's hot chicken in Nashville, Tennessee. And we're gonna find this Nashville hot chicken in a place you might not expect, a Chinatown strip mall. That's where chef Johnny Ray Zone, along with his wife Amanda, have opened a small storefront called Howlin' Ray's. Remember, I came with my grandma. Mm -hmm. Sweet, sweet lady. with my sweet little grandma. Yeah. I think I ordered a few different spice levels of the chicken. One of which almost killed me. Is this something you're? Tr are you trying to kill your customers? Are you? Yeah. I mean, we'll use a mix of like Carolina Reapers, which have a I think it's a two million uh, Scoville unit uh, rating. Then we'll use like ghost peppers, which are at your one million. And then some of the peppers we use also in our blend are specific for us. So for example, I use habaneros, but I, I like the young habanero in the red variety, and that's because it gives a certain kind of acidic quality uh, to the kind of spice. That, that I'm really fond of. Um, so we, we specifically order certain peppers at certain ages for it, uh, not only for the heat, but also for the flavor. Okay, let's eat some chicken. Awesome, thank you. Here we are. You must be cautious handling this chicken. If you touch this stuff, especially the hot stuff or the howlin', and you get your hands anywhere near a sensitive area, like your eyes or your nose or anything else, you are in for a world of pain. I used to live in El Salvador in a little house when I was in the Peace Corps, and I had a hot pepper tree. I picked some hot peppers, and then I went to go pee. I cried and I cried because it's just, you can't touch sensitive areas when you've been touching spicy things. You can't do anything about it. It's like you've contracted a horrible, horrible STD. Not that I know what that's like. What is that horrible noise? Do you hear that like, it sounds like a little mechanical dog? So Johnny said that they get their chicken from this farm called Mary's, which in the most humane way possible, they slaughter their animals. They, they put the chickens to sleep before they kill them. I think that's the best of a bad situation. I can't think of a, of a better way that I would like to go than in my sleep. So let's start with bachelor number one, mild. This is almost nothing on it. Even though it looks really hot, there we go. Look at my hands already. It's been literally 10 seconds. Okay. I will say the chicken itself is fantastic. The spice mixture is, it's almost sweet. It's a really nice mix of sweet and savory. Heat level, it's not hot. It looks hot, but it's, it's not hot. But there is a hint of spice there, which only makes me afraid for what's to come. We're getting into more serious territory now. I can already tell this is gonna be so bad. I can already tell. I will just have a big chunk of this and I'll pray for the best. That's spicy. It's not overdone. I really have to compliment them on the quality of the chicken. It's really outstanding. While I enjoyed my time at the Texas Chili Parlor, that chili wasn't hot. The XXX was this hot. Gentlemen, what are your names? Uh, Quantarius. Quantarius. It's nice to meet you. Let's do this because I got yeah. all over my hands. Quantarius. And, uh, Landon. Landon. Yeah. I'm Lucas. Nice to meet you. Lucas. It's very nice to meet you. Quantarius nice and Landon, how do you two know each other? Uh, well, we make uh, social media videos. We um, Vine and YouTube videos. And Are you guys Vine stars? Would you like to sample this hot? This hot? Well, I mean, I, I see you over here sweating right now. So I'm. I know. Towel? Do you need a towel? I need to mop myself with. I mean, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this <laughs> because this is. So I hope, you, yeah. hope you throw that away when you do No, 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 I'm gonna <laughs> eat it. Oh, oh, 
All right, I want you to try this wing. Just pull that wing off and, and give it a try. Is this the one I got you sweating? Yeah, this is hot. Okay. Just do it. That's not even the hottest, man. We that's that's that's. I got last... overactive sweat glands, so I mean, if you sweating right now, how are you feeling right now? Why is it so hot? Is it hot? Yes. Yeah, I can't tell if you're joking or if you actually. Do you? It's hot, it's hot right? Okay. <laughs> so let's get um let's get the Holland over here. You ready, Landon? You warm up, bro. You ready, Landon? All right, you ready? One, two, three. Oh, man. Woo! Woo! It's like radioactive fallout in my mouth. Oh. Do you know what that, it's like, um. I know that one is hot. <coughs> that one is hot. I'm drooling. That is like unbelievably hot. It is so oh. spicy. Are you sure you don't want to try this? Just, just, just try it, just try it. Why would I set myself I'm gonna take up? another bite. What kind of people? What? what? All right. <laughs> All right, you take another bite. I gotta take another bite. Big bite. I can't let you show me that up. That was a like big that. bite too. Big bite. No big bite. Oh, that's a big one. Yeah. Oh, let it burn. Let it burn. It's like on your lips. <laughs> it starts in your mouth, and then it like moves yeah. out to your lips, and then it kind of pervades your entire face. And I can only imagine I'm like turning red right now. The howling level is like novelty level. It's the level of spice if you want to, uh, I don't know, impress someone or like try to be macho with your friends or right, something like that. But like, cool guy. Oh, I really hope you enjoy this episode of Dining on a Dime, Los Angeles part de. If you would like to watch more, please click here. Thank you guys, that was pretty great.